New at six, uh, coronavirus vaccination clinic in the East Bay shut down for round two of shots after it reportedly wasn't giving shots to the right people. KPI X5, Julia Goodrich is outside that facility in Lafayette where the doctor behind it all says she didn't do anything wrong. Jules? Well, Ken, this pop-up clinic was here at this middle school in Lafayette. The doctor saying she followed all of the rules, but a complaint was filed saying that some of the extra doses at the end of the day were not given to the right people. The doctor says it was a misunderstanding. It was a community-driven vaccination day. More than 600 people getting their first round of the COVID shot. Our oldest patient was 100 and a half. Dr. Rebecca Parrish and other volunteer health professionals set up the pop-up vaccine clinic mid-January. A huge success, she thought. It was a really exciting thing. It was great. But then a complaint was filed with the county health department and medical board alleging doses were given to people who shouldn't have gotten them. The county was present at our clinic. Um, so we had county representatives that were there. Dr. Parrish said they followed Contra Costa County guidelines. She said some people under 65 did receive vaccinations, but that was at the end of the day when they realized they had close to 100 extra doses. And she says those doses went to seniors on a waiting list and first tier health care workers. You're saying that every single shot went into the arms of either someone in tier one someone over 65 and those that waited in the line. They followed those protocols, yes. The Contra Costa County Health Department released this statement to KPIX5 saying it has stopped giving additional doses to this clinic while records are reviewed. We will ensure that Contra Costa County residents who received their first dose from this clinic are provided second doses through county vaccination sites. Again, the scrutiny is okay. I mean, that's part of the deal. I mean, we talk about these vaccines, we talk about them as liquid gold. You know, I don't even know if that's accurate. Something more valuable than gold. All right, Juliet, uh, we, we saw that they're going to get them eventually, but where do the 600 people get their second shot? And if county officials are present, why isn't that enough uh, of a background check? Yeah, so it's important to note they will get their second shot. They'll be notified, but the doctor was saying it was just so much easier to have them come to a community-run facility where it's easy for these seniors to access. County officials allegedly were here, but they can't police everyone, and doctors can't be police either in terms of are you really 65, are you really 75? They just don't have that type of marking yet or that kind of background on each and every person. Yep, part of the problem that a lot of places are seeing yeah. right now. Julia Goodrich reporting live in Lafayette. Thank you.